Alright, so I'm trying to get to the capital, but I am like many, many miles away. And I'm a little low on water actually. I'm gonna stop for water somewhere. On the way, I wanna see if I can talk to any auto shop mechanics. See if I can get some ideas for my transmission problem. Pretty much it's not cheap, I'm thinking. Although it does sound good, it just has an over-revving problem. I'm just gonna figure that out. But I'm still in Meridian, so I gotta leave Meridian to get to Boise. And it's all a long distance, but it's such a, it's such a straightaway. It's just goes, I just go straight down one road pretty much and I almost get to the capital. Probably get water at Albertsons. The geese might have made a nest on top of this building here. There's three geese just parked. It's for sale, so it hasn't been used. Okay, so making a note, this is McDonald's and Fred Meyer. It's, it's kind of possible to sleep in the Fred Meyer lot. So many unique businesses along this street. Still don't really see an, any kind of like an auto shop, so it's it's gonna take some looking, and I don't have much confidence in finding it further into the metropolis. I'm not even sure. I forget how big Boise is. Wow, there's a lot of goose poop. Go geese are around. So heading into Boise, you can see that there's still some farm fields off in the distance of Toys R Us. Yeah, there's there's definitely um, like a clash between agrarian lifestyles and city life. What is the deal with this? This is some major shopping right here. You got several of these types of signs. And lots of large, large buildings. It looks like a fairly new shopping area since the trees are kind of tiny. Maybe a couple years old, a few years old. What is H&M? What is Axiom? Kind of feel like royalty. Secret. Okay, well, if I wanted to come in closer to Boise, I could sleep at this Walmart because they're against the RVs. As I say, it's not easy driving RVs. You're better off scaling down if you want to open up your options for places to sleep. You know, as close as I like to think of getting to those mountains, it still feels like they're the same distance away. Maybe that's just because they're that immense. Looks like the, the Kmart's closing. get 
closer into Boise, I'm sure things get get more expensive. Actually, I think I'm in Boise. I mean, the capital, I guess. And look, there's there's a mobile emissions testing. I didn't know. I didn't know they could be mobile. I see two, and I've seen two so far. To admit right now I failed to see any sign that welcomed me to Boise all right they don't make them very large or if they make them at all I'm sure they do make them I just missed it all right after covering a lot of miles this is my first incline it's not that great but it's there This feels a little dangerous bicycling because of the low railing. But it's pretty neat to look at. Although I'll just let the camera look, I'll watch it later. I'll stare straight ahead and make sure everything is safe. It looks pretty big, looks this this highway. Some kind oh no. Okay. I can't even ride down a decline like this without brakes. Okay, I'm a little uh, disappointed in the mountain behind Boise here. Uh, I think it looks immense because the ground all around, especially particularly on the way to this direction, is all flat. So uh, I'm just measuring it against one straight plane of flat ground. As I get closer, it, it looks climbable. I mean. I could see the trees on the top pretty fairly like individually. All right, so I stopped at the McDonald's and went and used their bathroom again at the third or fourth McDonald's that I passed on the way here so far. There's still one more McDonald's to pass before you go to the before I go to the, the capital, if I make it. Geese in the graveyard. Geese are all over this area. Alright, so this is the first park, and it's loaded full of ducks, geese, and seagulls. Like a bit of a dam. I think this is probably Boise River. Got the green belt downtown. I think those are bicycle trails. I'm not far from that library. I want to check it out. Get see if there's internet available. Not exactly sure where the library is, but it should be right ahead. There's some pretty tall buildings around here. This is pretty much downtown. Okay, the library is a couple buildings over. Hey 
you can see a big sign that says library with an exclamation point. And you can see a lot of high rises off in the distance. So this is this is looking at downtown.